specialists here at South, Kelly and Courtney. We are going to tell you a little bit about our new book room and rise room. We're located in the Kiva now, so we wanted to help you know where everything is in the book room. So first thing is we have a vast, vast library of level text. So these are for you teachers. Please take them, please use them with your kids. You um, can, there's some older texts, there's some newer texts we got last year. All you have to do, grab what you need um, for your small groups, whatever you need is appropriate for your classroom and just sign them out in the little book room binder. This is organized by grade level, so you're going to sign the books out under the child's homeroom teacher. So if you send um, somebody else with the child, they can sign it out under uh, teacher's names. Also, if you look at the very top of these shelves, we've got a mentor text library. Let's say in Making Meaning you are working on problem and solution. You can come find the problem and solution bin and there's some mentor text that will um, help your instruction with that skill. We do have a stool, since they're up by, you can grab the stool and reach the bin. We also have some sound bins. If your students are working on their letter sounds, these are great hands-on resources to sort those sounds out. There's also some decodable sets and alphabet books here for your uh, students that are learning their alphabet and some other activities. You are more than welcome to check out those resources. To help your uh, small groups, we have uh, the Scholastic Guided Reading Short Reads. We have both fiction in the white binders and nonfiction in the black binders. Our fiction uh, short reads go from level M to level T and our nonfiction goes from level J to level W. These are great because you can grab the binder and they have a list of all the texts inside on that level. You have a copy of the text for the people in your group to read. You also have a teacher page that will guide you through your lesson that includes uh, some comprehension questions and these are great because you already have it planned for you to use. We also are working on a decodable library. So if there's a specific feature that your students just aren't getting and you need another resource, please come, use whatever you need. We have uh, some older decodables, but are certainly appropriate for teaching phonics, but we also have some newer ones who are more than welcome to check out and use with your students. This room is also going to be our RISE room this year. You'll see RISE stations happening in this room from 8.45 to 10.45. Use our resource room. This is here for you teachers and we are always here to help. Yes, please let us know if you have any questions or want to know where anything is in the room.